1217 the Aerotel, London Heathrow. So we've, we've already been in, turn the lights on, just for the room tour, no, it's, it's really nice actually, it's not, it's not as tiny as I thought it was probably. No, oh there's me, so yeah it's a nice full length mirror, there's a Becca, and you've got con controls on the wall for control and conditioning, ooh, shower, okay we really like this, oh it is really nice, so is it a rainfall, yeah rainfall shower, then notice, please remember to close bathroom door when showering the steam may activate our fire alarm. It's a thing to yeah, notice. I was going to have a shower with the door open. Don't know. Obviously someone's done that before. It's probably a heat and steam thing. Um, there's a sprinkler system right above the um, shower. Yeah. It's quite nice. Got a hair dryer. So, all, all the normal stuff. It's quite nice. I think this was just under £100 for the night, which compared to the Hilton over the road, which was £150. So we thought we'd save a little bit of money. So nice double bed or king size? King. It's bigger mm. than one we've got at home. Yeah. Nice big fluffy pillows. Oh, up there's so. Yeah, that's true. Some more for us. We've got a regular plug socket. Two USBs both sides, I think. some nice nighttime lights. So, okay, where's the USBs? There's one, two in my socket on my side. Okay, one side has USBs, one side doesn't. And there's two more plugs underneath there as well. Oh, yeah, so two USBs, perfect. Chair, little table, little bed, or oh, a big bed. I think I need to calibrate it again. But there we go. So yeah, perfect for the morning or the evening. Because we we got here an hour early. So it means that we've got to check out an hour early. It's just because it's done on an hourly thing. So you can book this one for We could have paid an extra tenner to stay the extra hour, but we were gonna be leaving about quarter past half past six anyway, so it Hello. Um, welcome to our latest vlog series. So this is have uh, been a long time coming. It's been... I don't know how many days and oh, I've lost count of how many cancelled slash postponed trips. Seven, I think it's a seven, either five or seven trips and oh, on various yeah. things. That's probably five. August, November, May, October, November, November. Technically six. Six. This will be, this will be try, lucky number six. Lucky number six, okay. so. What's quite lucky about it, we are here. We, we are, here. We are <laughs> at, at the airport. Yep. Yeah. Unless something crazy happens overnight and borders close. I can't see that happening. I tomorrow, know, okay. tomorrow is the 8th of November. So we've. Yeah. So we are flying out to Orlando tomorrow. I can't believe that. I can't believe we actually. You can't believe you just said that. We're actually going. We are flying out to Orlando tomorrow. Yep. Yeah. We're flying through um, from Heathrow, JFK. Last November, we did get some flights, which was supposed to have been for April, but we got a bargain, upper class flights through Virgin Atlantic. It worked out about £995 each. Rough was a steal. And that was upper class there and back. So it wasn't just one way. And as, as council trips happened, we had to move the flights and every time we went on, oh, no, they're gonna wanna up the price. And we paid a little bit more for, went from April to October. But um, because they cancelled in October and the 1st of November, it means that we kept the price for what they were now selling the flights for about £14,000. So, bargain of the century, basically, so, yeah. these flights. So, I'm so glad this trip's happening. So, yeah. anyway, back to the actual flights. We are, there wasn't any direct flights available through Virgin. Yep. So, we're flying with Delta from Heathrow to JFK and then with Delta from JFK to MCI. Yeah. We've got about a two hour layover at JFK, so hopefully that'll be enough time. It shouldn't be an issue. I've had a look, because we're going upper class uh, with Jeff um, through Delta. They've, it's part of their Sky Flight, which means that you get um, a lot of priority baggage you, and other things. There's also priority immigration. So, so we'll as long as the lane is open, I think we can get in it and we'll speed through. Okay. But we'll let you know then. 
yeah. we'll find out later on in yeah. this vlog probably either this vlog or tomorrow's, or tomorrow's so i haven't got much footage for today so probably be today's vlog yeah you know what i mean pre-travel so, day and travel day are going to be combined yeah yeah so we are staying because we booked so last minute yeah. there wasn't much available on dbc we're staying at four different resorts we're staying at four different resorts yep one of which we had to pay for out of pocket because there was nothing available. No, for those three days that's, when we booked it. No, that's that wasn't it. What was it not? No, we didn't have enough points because we didn't oh, think right. this trip was going to happen, so we decided to rent out half of our points allocation, and okay. that's why. So, oh, to be fair, there still wasn't anything available. There is now, <laughs> but yeah, because that's why we booked those tickets. So yeah, we are going to be once we land at Walt Disney World tomorrow, we're going to get the Magical Express. For the last, last time, time. second to last time, we'll get it on the way home. No, it's not, ma it's not magical on the way home, it's tragical, but yeah, and anyway. it really is. We're going to be checking in Polynesian for three, three nights. nights, yeah, <clears throat> and then we're moving on to our paid for out of pocket section of the trip, Grand Estino Grand Hotel, Estino Tower. At Coronado Springs for three nights, yep. You can and on. You can on, see where this is going. I'm sure it's not actually. It, it, it no, was. It's not. It was. It's well, changed. Yeah, there's been a few changes and a few it keeps issues. Changing things. Oh, availability keeps changing, and then it's like, oh, I don't know where should we stay. Mad. Okay, but we're staying. Keep getting texts about all week. I kept getting text messages going. Such and such has come available. Should we swap? Like, I don't care. I just want to go. Yeah. I don't care where we stay. Okay. We're, so anyway, we're back. now staying four nights. After going to see the town at Animal Kingdom Lodge, Kadani Savannah View. So, and I think what sold that was we have the idea of going to Sanal. Sanal for takeaway bread service. And just going, sitting on the balcony and just chilling, relaxing, and just, oh, yeah. When we said Kadani last night was lovely, but we had a car park view. So let's hope to this. Be fair, the car park view wasn't terrible, it was basically trees. Yeah, it's true. It, it, it was trees and they were redecorating they it. They were redecorating it. So, yeah. so let's be careful when we're using the balcony. But yeah, um, and then we are on to our latest adaptation oh, yeah. Yeah. of... There's been a bit of a mess up with booking availability with DVC. This next one, my phone member services to book, but they booked the wrong one that I realised a day later. Um, and it's like it's so close to where... We are keeping where, an eye out and hoping we'll so, be able to change it. But at the minute, we are going to Copper Creek for two nights. The first night is in a one bedroom villa and the second night is in a deluxe studio. So that's four hotels, five rooms. <laughs> Six if you can include this one. Six if you include this one. So um, it's going to be a fun trip, it really is. So um, we're not unpacking. Like, we're, you know, we're, we're probably going to bring a lot of stuff home. Well we certainly brought enough stuff to bring stuff back in. Yeah that's true. We've got suitcases and suitcases and suitcases. It's like a Russian doll of suitcases. Yeah. So yeah, um, there's not really much for tonight, we're just going to chill, yep. Grand Prix's on, so that's my priority tonight, I think. Uh, yeah, his his priority. And I think... I don't know what, we'll see, we, maybe. Yeah, so... We'll see you in the morning. Waffle. <laughs>